details on his first international hunting trip. It's not a bad introduction. He's stalking in the ancient forests of northeastern Hungary, courtesy of Wonderheart Hunting. The hunting in the past has been pretty much what well, the UK type hunting. I've been to Red Deer in Scotland, Roe Deer down south, Munjag around Essex, Cambridgeshire. A lot of, a lot of feral pigeons and, and rats and rabbits and all that kind of things. So to come out here and to experience a European hunt with the variety of animals that are here is absolutely amazing. We've been here less than 24 hours and already we've seen red deer, roe deer, pigs, mouflon now, and apparently there's bears and wolves and everything in this forest. It's a stunning, stunning place. He's told our guide that he's after meat for the table, so the recommendation is a young boar or mouflon. We know there's plenty of game here, but it's tough going when we're in the midst of a Central European heat wave. With temperatures in the high 30s, the animals are sitting tight and moving at night, so we need to be out and at them early. Just a few hundred yards from our drop-off, there's a sounder of boar 60 yards in front of us. They know something's afoot, but don't make a run for it. The guide gestures to Kai to take one of the piglets. Kai picks one out in the semi-darkness, standing between the trees. He shoots and drops the piglet. Unfortunately, it's the piglet to the right of the other one, between the trees. So we just come into the woods, it's about 5am, and our guide took us a half hour drive up through the mountains for the forest. It's a beautiful drive. We just came here, just come round the corner, about 10 minutes into the stalk, we we'll see, we'll see a family of pigs up in the woods. A guy told us to take the young one, I was in between the trees. So I got ready and took it out. Straight behind the neck. Nice small little big loop. Communication is key when out hunting. Anyway, we have a young boar for the pot. The guide wants us to carry on and see what else might be about. With the sun starting to reach the forest floor, the guide stops and just watches for a few minutes. It pays off because, unbeknown to us, on the other side of our position, two mouflon have ventured out into the open. Kai spots them as we turn to retread our steps. A young ewe is grazing on moss on a fallen tree. She presents a longish but good shooting opportunity. It's a great shot. Within an hour, we have a young boar and mouflon before the heat pushes the animals into thick cover. I'm really pleased with that. The first mouflon that I've, that I've shot. It was a nice shot as well. Went straight through, straight through the engine room. It dropped straight away. When we got closer, it's a bit smaller than I thought it was going to be because we're quite a distance back. But I would say it's probably about 150, 180 yards back. But really happy. Good shot. We take that way now. Back to the larder. Thank you again. Yeah. <laughs> Been a bit of a mixed bag this morning. Really pleased though. We've got, we've got two really nice animals. We've got a small piglet and a ewe. Unfortunately, David had not been to Spec Savers. And we, uh, he missed the pig I was looking at. But we did get it. And uh, shortly after, we've got this lovely young ewe. Both will make exceptional eating. For more information about hunting in Hungary, go to wonderheart.co.uk. For more information about Kai's hunting gear, go to shooterking.co.uk. And for more about the Zawa rifle, go to zawa.de.